Welcome to Optical Communication Playlist. Here in this session, I'll be going to explain equilibrium numerical aperture. So to explain that, step by step, I will explain how we try to understand equilibrium numerical aperture, how I have explained losses in terms of numerical aperture. So all those things that I'll be explaining step by step. So see, when you, when we give light source to the optical fiber of short length around 1 to 2 meter in that case usually we attached fly leads and that fly leads that we attach to get lower coupling losses and you will be observing certain amount of power is getting lost because of coupling loss and that power loss is there in the range of 0 0.1 to 0 0.2 dB. But in addition to that coupling loss, some excess power loss will occur in first 10 to 50 meter of multimode fiber. So we need to understand what is that excess loss which is happening in the length of 10 to 50 meter of multimode fiber. See this excess loss is a result of non-propagation modes scattering out of fiber as a launch mode come out to equilibrium condition. So this axis loss that is happening because of scattering of multi-mode fiber which is there in that optical fiber and that power will get lost out of fiber as you go for further distance. So this loss is more in surface emitting LED and this loss is less in laser. So this axis loss is more due to scattering of light in case of LED and that axis loss is less in laser as it is less prone to laser. So ultimately when we apply light to the fiber of short length of fiber in that case this axis, length, axis loss will be more but for long length of fiber this axis less loss will be less as that axis scattered non-propagating mode that will get uh, radiated out of fiber so you'll be finding this axis loss of mode that will be actually degrading with respect to length so this axis loss can be represented in terms of numerical aperture now i'll explain that how it can be represented in terms of numerical aperture See, if you see the length of fiber here in X axis, I have shown length of fiber and in Y axis, I have shown numerical aperture. So as you increase length, this numerical aperture that is decreasing up to 50 meter of length and after 50 meter of length, that numerical aperture that is getting constant. So that constant numerical aperture is considered as numerical aperture equilibrium and at input means at distance 0 numerical aperture that is numerical aperture in. So this is what the point where we have input numerical aperture. Now see light acceptance is described in terms of numerical aperture. If area of LED is less than area of core then we can say numerical aperture is equals to numerical aperture in. So that is this point. And when optical power that is measured in long multimode fiber with the distance greater than 50, at that time you will be getting equilibrium numerical aperture. And as a part of this, we can say optical, optical power that will be equilibrium optical power that is equals to P50 into numerical aperture equilibrium divided by numerical aperture in whole square where P50 that is what power expected at 50 meter of launch of the fiber. So ultimately here agenda is see that axis loss of power that will be getting zero as you move further with 50, dis 50 meter distance and that axis loss of power that will be more for short length of fiber. So ultimately when we communicate for short distance communication with multi-mode fiber in that case this axis loss due to scattering of light is very important. 
एंड द डिग्री ऑफ कपलिंग द डिग्री ऑफ कपलिंग इज अ फंक्शन ऑफ कोर क्लेडिंग रिफ्रेक्टिव इंडेक्स डिफरेंस एंड इट कैन बी वेरी सिग्निफिकेंटली विद द डिफरेंट फाइबर्स मोस्ट फाइबर अटेन्स एटी टू नाइंटी परसेंट इज इक्वली ब्रियम ऑफ न्यूमेरिकल एपर्चर एट फिफ्टी मीटर डिस्टेंस सो न्यूमेरिकल एपर्चर इक्वली ब्रियम इज इम्पॉर्टेंट वेन वी कैलकुलेट लॉन्च पावर इन फाइबर एंड इवन आई हैव इवन आई हैव कैलकुलेटेड लॉन्च पावर इन स्टेप इंडेक्स फाइबर यूजिंग एल ई डी एंड लॉन्च पावर इन ग्रेडेड इंडेक्स फाइबर यूजिंग एल ई डी so where you will be observing this is very important parameter which is what numerical aperture when we calculate launch power so this launch power that will be having significance for shorter distance communication due to axis loss which is happening due to scattering and that is what explained by equilibrium numerical aperture here in this session Thank you so much for watching this video you can give your valuable suggestions definitely based on it in future i'll make videos to sort out all those queries thank you so much